Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 17 here on Chanel Tons Farms. Picking up gonna be the same day folks, but we are starting uh we're going to finish our mowing episode here. We started off at the last episode. Um just doing some touch up here. Uh, as you know, we got a John Deere baler last time, and uh, I got something even more interesting to show y'all here in just a minute. As soon as I get this little circle done here, so I'm getting dizzy first. Um, still ain't got the combines up to the shop yet. Uh, basically, um, went around to my wood shacks, my log mills, and stuff and uh, up all the pallets up so they would sell so I could get this other piece um, so yeah um, I'm going to go right down through here uh, the hired worker did pretty good on this field uh, I'm, that's why I'm glad I took that other field and plowed it made it one big field because it's going to be awesome uh, you can just hire a worker it'll mow it for you and yeah so but anyway folks uh i hope y'all doing okay and uh if you're not you know god bless may god help you out and stuff but if you are doing okay that's awesome um can't remember what episode this is folks uh been recording this I guess you can say this is my recording day. Let me back up that little strip there so it looks good. Um like I probably done told y'all in some of the other episodes you're probably getting tired of hearing it because you know it's been the same day for me and I've just been rambling, rambling, rambling. Let me hop out for a second so I can turn my hood on. So I know what to shut off here. Raise all them up. I'm just going back this guy out of the way because we are going to be using him again. But we might change up uh, a little brush right there. Might be just changing the mower around and hooking to a tether because here's our thing, folks. The Coon Wind Roller. Merge Max 902, folks. You can uh, make this thing shoot all of it to the left. You make it shoot all up to the right, or you can open up the middle. And here's our baler from last time, the John Deere 690. Folks, all this stuff is on the mod hub, so that's why I don't leave no links to my stuff. Because if I get a Dropbox or anything and, and upload my stuff, you know, maybe a month from now that might not work. So that's why, you know, it's all on mod hub. It's, Search in, you know, farming similar mods, they'll pull up mod hub. It's this uh, mod and hub dot, you know, com or whatever, and it should bring it all up. Let's go ahead and get this guy started. And we're going to uh, turn this baler on. Let's see what all functions it's got. Uh, I don't see very much there. We don't even have a counter on it, which I hate that for. Let's go ahead and lower it down. I uh, got the things there going. They don't look too bad for a John Deere mod. Um, did I lock on? No, I did not. I did that last time and it hurt. I'm going to leave it at 20. Um... Yeah, for uh, that to work like that, yeah, I'm going to have to change the settings on this. Uh, you see right here, this uh, right, the uh, left bumper I'm pulling is just fold, merger, lower. But if I hit the right bumper, uh, start engine, work mode right, toggle beacons, uh, we're going to hit right bumper and Y. Uh, that's the middle, left, right, middle. We're going to do middle, since he's going to be following us. 
So we're going to lower this thing down. And let's get started. I kind of like what this thing looks. Oops, 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 oops. Let's turn it on first. There we go. There we go. It's putting everything in the middle. And it says we can hire workers, so we're going to try it up here. Uh, I think I probably got too close. Oh no, it'll, it'll bend through, okay. Is our guy following us? Yes, he is, okay. I know I'm going to have to get past these trees, folks, before I can uh, hire a worker and actually work right, because it's going to censor a tree and be wanting to turn around. Wow, we can do up to 14. Our baler's keeping up with us, too. There's the only thing about it, our hired worker's not going to come all the way out to here. So we'll probably have to come back and get that. So. All right, there goes the bales. Uh, let's go ahead and hire a worker, see what he does. I don't know why these are always set to six mile an hour. I'm doing good. All right, we're going to fall behind, take a look at our... Uh, see, this has got a flat belt. It's got a picker ripper. Throws it onto a flat belt. And, and that's real, too, folks. I seen him, well, not in real life, but I saw him on YouTube. Real live situation. Let's take a look at our bales getting kicked out here. All right, seems to be working pretty good. And he's going to back up. Uh, okay. We're going to have to watch our bales real close so make sure where they kick out from. Probably going to have to clean up a little bit. All right, let's, uh, oh my, our truck is full. Let's just go ahead and uh, run this guy over. Oh, wow. Got a lot of bales. Um, yeah, we got to get the, our disc is done. We got a fellow fertilized buggy up. But we also got to take care of our bales. Uh, our round bales are full. So uh, these here will be pure credit. Which will probably even pay back our uh, uh, buying our stuff. Because, uh, ooh, 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 that's how that's been happening. I'm going to try to sneak through right here. Yeah, there we go. That's supposed to be our selling point. Yep, there we go. Seven, 5,000 to 17,000, so 12,000. Is that right? $12,000 for that load? Not bad. So we're going to have a bunch of loads on this. And yes, folks, this is all still the same day now. I realize how much work we're doing in one day. Um, it's almost 3 o'clock. 3 minutes to 3. On game time. Actually, in real life, it's 3.23 p.m. Well, right, what we got to do down here, we're going to go ahead and set our thing back. We got some bales that rolled out down here a little bit. It's going to go through, pick all them up.
I don't know how he went across here. It's almost like he's going in a circle. Who is it anyway? It's done stopped. Stopped up there, so we'll go through here. Didn't do too good of a job, hard worker. Oh man, we're going to pull before we get to the top. Imagine picking bells up this fast in real life. Holy cow, what happened right here? Oh, all of them load rolled down. Oh, I should have set a course play route. When this truck gets full, it goes into the selling point. Alright, well. We'll go ahead and uh take this load up there and then we're gonna switch over to something else real fast. We need to uh, fill up the fertilizer. Um, I think we need to work on getting that grass up first, folks, before we do any more with the straw bales. Because I don't think the straw bales is going to deteriorate as fast as that grass will because it's not baled. Plus, we can get that one combine in place. go through here uh, seven eighteen thousand thirty thousand whoa folks that's that's gonna do it right there real quick that's, that's uh pick up some uh, grass bales All right, let's do that Our fields look like they're ready, but they're not. Right, let me check. Just let me just double check here. Showing 71 and 67 by the checker, so they're not ready. All right, I'm gonna have to change this from brown bells. Uh, I get out of this. Oh yeah. Come on. Square bales, work position. All right, let's go over here and pick these up first. I need to change the Kentucky truck out to uh, one that has the hitch on the front, so we can uh, won't have to worry about hitting bales. Maybe we'll get a full load off of this. Getting pretty close. Oh no. Oh. I need to fix this real quick. Stop pushing. Stop being a bully. Let dump that out. Okay. I don't know what happened to this guy. We're just going to turn him around real quick. Back up a little bit. Down on. Oh, it's going to miss a little bit. That should do it about right there. Get back here, get this guy set to follow me. Okay. I'm going to put 25 back. Then we're going to get the truck to uh, finish picking up some of these bales real quick. Let's see, everything's clear around the edge here. 
get this and everything clear down here so we'll be good to go um, oh man come on so I need two more bales and this thing be ready to go take so I'm gonna put it on follow me to get those two bales all right let's get this party started I like how fast this thing goes. Alright, so I guess we'll be keeping this tractor after all. Let's get rid of this box here for a second. I was actually going to sell a couple of these tractors, get some John Deere ones, but. I don't know. We'll, we'll probably still get some John Deere ones, but see that truck needs one more bail. And he is full. But I'm going to not worry about it and try to get all this right here picked up. Uh oh please don't hit me ah always a bully in a bunch all right we are done this thing folds up pretty fast too I like it Now this is a, if I'm not mistaken, a 9.1 meter, and our mower is 8.1, so that's good too. Okay, I want to fire the. I'm just gonna. Pull through the lean tube here and get behind the mower. Perfect. Now let's go back over here. Probably gonna have to fire him too. Let's just go ahead and do the truck. Cause I gotta get really close to this uh, fence here to get the piece I left right up here. Or did I done pass it? Uh, oh no, it's right there. I see it now. Spot right here. Okay. Poop out these remaining two. Oh man, I forgot to go around. Look at like that's all done though. Oh, I got a spot right there. It's not even. Well, I got a little bit right there. It's not really worth getting, so we're going to go ahead and uh, fold this guy up. God, it got dirty fast. And I think we're going to trade in our Kentucky truck for one that has a bumper on the front. So we can put that bumper on. All right, let's go get our truck. We got getting a good crew right there. We still got a good crew out in the yard or down there for the combines. Now this guy's full, and we got what one bale? Oh man, one bale! I'll tell you what. We're going to unload, uh, unload center. Alright, we got that loaded. And looks like all 
just this one. And I know this ain't realistic, but uh, actually, square bells, a person can pick them up. They're a little heavy, but they're uh, where you can pick them up. And I'm on this. Uh, all right, perfect. This strap right here. I'll hold that down. And we got two down there. I'm going to put on here real quick. The reason why I use the front of the truck is that for game mode, I can just easily walk up. I'm going to put this towards the back right here. I know I strapped this down, but... I can't undo it. Figures. Try to get it back a little ways so I can. There we go. Oh, please don't. Whew, the second there, I thought I scooted it off. Alright. Alright, let's go on over here, store these away, and see what we need next. But our field right here is not ready. I'll check it here in just a second before we go. But this is probably going to be the end of this episode. I'm going to go do some straw picking up. position undo drop so we still need some more grass bales park out of the way here need 14 grass bales and 22 hay bales and our straw we need one bale ha <laughs> one bale would be full wow But yeah, all we got left, uh, let's see, this field, I was going to go probe this field. Yeah, here a little ways. 33% folks, it's not nearly ready. But it is coming up, oh, look how beautiful. Betsy and Sally and wherever Bubba is, having a good time. You like the new grass field, Betsy? Oh, it's yummy. Oh, okay. Cool. Well, there's our straw. The round bales are full. Uh, go over here and show you. Straw bales, zero storage space. 120 bales there. We like one bale from having that full there. And then we got 96,167 liters in the mixer. Need uh, some grass put in the sullage. And we need uh, some more grass bales here. So uh, I guess we'll make another load of grass bales here pretty soon. Um, we'll have to go around the edges of these fields. Like down there where we was working 17 and 18, we can go mow that before. Uh, Matter of fact, I, I think that's what we're going to do. I might do it off screen, folks. And uh, I got some rye going to sell, too. And I got the truck loaded. That's why one reason I'm trying to drive it in the fields, folks. It's because you can see all the darker green is where grass has been laid down. And the lighter green, I can mow. Which I can mow with the dark green, too. Ah! Y'all did not see that. Y'all didn't see that. But anyway. I think I'm... Yeah, because see if I drive out here, I won't be smashing all that grass down. Uh, oh, Lord. I got to go back to round bells. 
There we go. I'm gonna pick all these up and then go back to the baler, get back behind it. Oh, I think I'm gonna have another load before I even get to the baler if I pick all these up. Let's see here. I got a few right here. The kids are, uh, I hear the car doors, so the kids are home, so folks. Uh, it's been uh, 25 minutes anyway. I'm going to finish this field off screen probably since they're going to be here. Um, then uh, when we come back we'll probably plow a little bit. We, we just, I'm not going to fast forward the clock none because we got a lot of work to do. Probably working into the night. So anyway folks I'm going to get off here. So uh Thanks for all the, uh, oh, I should turn the bear on. All the love and support y'all has given me. Uh, the comments, I love them, folks. I haven't had a bad comment in a while, and I love that. So keep that up. And uh, I'll keep making videos for y'all. In the meantime, y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I will see y'all later, folks. Wish me luck on all this belly. Later.